Now that you have finally understood the classes of land here in Nigeria in my last video, let's now take a look at the basic land documents in Nigeria that you need today. Alright, the first document I'll be discussing in this video is the deed of assignment. Okay, the deed of assignment is basically an agreement that shows the transfer of ownership, rights and title from the seller to the buyer. Okay, the next document on our list is the Gazette. In Nigeria, it is a document that records land details like the excision granted to communities or an individual. It specifies the area allocated to these communities, their specific uses and conditions for that land. Okay? Now, for a land buyer or an investor, the Gazette is very important because it verifies the legitimacy of that land transaction as well as to show if this land falls under government acquisition or not. Now, a deed of assignment and a Gazette are key documents that ensures the transfer of land to you. Next one is excision. Now, an excision involves legally separating a portion of land, right? And the excised part is now documented in the government Gazette. Like I said in part one, in general acquisition, you can cut out a piece of it and you, you know go register it as a free land. Now this ensures that the land is no longer under government acquisition. Now without excision, the government can reclaim the land without compensating you in the future. So this is why it is very important to confirm the excision status of the land you are about to buy. Now this is very important for both land owners and investors as it secures legal rights of that specific portion of land. All right. Now in summary, excision is legally separating a piece of land from the government, registering it in a gazette so that it is free to be sold. That way, the government cannot reclaim this land in the future because it has been registered as a free land. The next one I'll be talking about is the CFO and the governor's consent. Now, a CFO is a certificate obtained from the government to show ownership and legitimacy over that plot of land, okay? The CFO can only be issued and registered once. Now, the initial person to be granted a C of O, that is a legal C of O, is the only person's name that can appear on that C of O forever. Right? A C of O has a tenure of 99 years, which it can be renewed later on after 99 years. Okay. When you want to buy a land that already has a C of O as its title document, you are issued a deed of assignment transferring ownership from the first person that registered that C of O to you or to the next buyer of that property. Now, the original C of O or the root of title will be given to you and those that will buy afterwards. When you take this deed of assignment and go to register it or identify with the government that you are now the new owner of that land, it becomes the governor's consent. Now, the governor then issues a letter of consent or he signs on the deed of assignment acknowledging you as the new owner of that particular property make sure to do your due diligence you can check if the land has been excised properly registered and is free from any government ownership all right you can find out this information in the gazette or your deed of assignment that will be given to you for your search in summary the deed of assignment gazette C of O, that is certificate of occupants, and your governor's consent are very crucial documents to look out for when dealing with land transactions here in Nigeria. They provide legal protection and ensures that your ownership rights are properly recognized and also ensures that that property you are about to buy is well secured and genuine. In some states, documents like power of attorney, allocation, paper, and your registered survey are used to show transfer of ownership but it is advisable to add a basic document from what i just mentioned today to be on a safe side make sure to confirm that the property you are about to buy is well registered and approved by the government okay i hope this video helps you in making an informed decision when it comes to real estate here in nigeria right let me know if you have any more questions in the comment section below okay and don't forget to like subscribe to my channel and turn on the notification bell also share this video to your friends and family who are looking to invest 
or buy a property here in Nigeria. You can also give me a call today or WhatsApp me on 091-3503-2736. Let me help you to secure your real estate investment here in Enugu or your buy and build plots too. I remain your number one realtor in the city of Enugu, Victoria, Chins Room. I am always here to guide you in making the right real estate investment and as well as help you in building wealth through real estate. Okay, thanks for watching and happy investing. See you on the next one. Bye.